Welcome everyone, it is Andrew here from iDownloadBlog. We have a quick tip today, which is how to charge your iPad Pro at over twice as fast as it does with the included charger. Now, admittedly, this is not so much a tip as a thing to buy that makes this work better. And what I am talking about is the new USB-C to lightning cable, as well as Apple's 29 watt USB-C wall charger. The cable itself is very thick and it comes in two different lengths. There's a one meter length for $25 and a two meter length for $35. So you have two different options. The one that comes with your iPad Pro is going to be the two meter length. So roughly the equivalent of that. Also a good point to mention, this is not a cheap way to improve the charging speed, but it is drastically different than the one that's coming out of the box. Personally, I have actually had my iPad Pro plugged in and had the battery going down while I'm using it. So this is a much better option. You're gonna have something like this that actually came with your iPad. It's gonna be a 12 watt power adapter. You'll also see some 10 watts, but these are about the same size. They uh, work for any of the iPads out there. And the cord is very thin. It's a very thin lightning to USB cable. Then there is the 29 watt power charger and you'll see on the bottom, let's say 29 watt USB type C power adapter. This is quite a bit bigger. It's also the exact same one that goes with the MacBook. So if you already have the 12 inch MacBook that charges on USB-C, you are all good to go. The cable that comes with it is a significantly thicker cable, which is more robust and sturdy and hopefully not going to fray as easily as Apple's cables are known to do for the iPhone and iPad that they currently ship. So how fast does this charge? Over twice as fast, about two and a half times. So I got to about 20% in about 25 minutes or so with the 29 watt charger. And I got to about only seven or 8% with the 12 watt charger in the same amount of time. So it charges really over two times faster because this is going over USB 3 and the iPad Pro can take that full 29 watt that's coming from the adapter. Now that does apply solely to the 12.9 inch iPad Pro. So the new 9.7 inch iPad Pro will not be able to take advantage of that full speed. That cable will charge any device, it just won't get that full speed that the iPad Pro 12.9 inch is capable of. If you have any questions, let us know below and please subscribe if you found this video useful. And until next time, this is Andrew for iDownloadBlog.